Hello everyone. So welcome back to my channel. I know I have been um, silent for a little bit, but we are back and today I'm going to be showing you how I blow dry my hair, do my hair during quarantine slash every day of my life. And I am going to be showing you some skincare that I've been doing. I really can't say daily, but when I want to get ready, I have been doing it and a little makeup look so you look alive and you don't scare those that you're stuck with. So thanks so much for watching and let's get into it. Okay, first thing, I am going to blow dry my hair and I am going to be using this Revlon round brush blow dryer. And I'm gonna blow dry my hair real quick and then show you guys what I do after. Now that my hair is about 80% dry, my roots are still a little damp, I like to use a slip scrunchie and put it in a low bun so it just continues to dry. But I like the way my hair looks when I take it out of a bun. So I just dry it in a bun. I don't know if that makes sense. So I just do a low bun. Wrap it with a scrunchie so no um, dents are left. And then I just hang out. Um, I am also going to be showing you what I have been doing on my face. Now for skincare. I am going to be using this Tula Clear It Up Acne Clearing and Correcting Gel. This stuff is the bomb. My skin actually really can't live without it. I just take a little pump, squirt it into my hands, apply it all over my face. Little goes a long way. I don't have crazy problematic skin, but sometimes when I don't use any face products or any skincare, because sometimes I can get lazy, um, my face likes to break out in like the hormonal spots. Pardon me. Okay. Next, I'm using Ole Henriksen True Serum. This is collagen boosted with True C Complex. It's just vitamin C serum. I'll show you. I've been using this stuff since like 10th grade. Comes out orange. Again, a little goes a long way. And I like to take it down onto my neck as well. I feel like vitamin C serum, like especially this one, it's not oily. So it really like, um, I like the feeling of my face feeling tightened. So I feel like that does that. Okay, next I am going to be using my Ole Henriksen Banana Bright Eye Cream. This stuff is the bomb. It makes me look alive, makes my under eyes look a little refreshed. And I like to put it under my eyes with my ring finger and then up here on my brow bone. The hope is that all of this skincare helps you out in the long run when you get older. So, fingers crossed. Okay. Now I'm going to be using my tried and true jet lag mask by Summer Fridays. This stuff can be used just as a mask and then you can wash it off after a couple minutes, but I like to use it as my moisturizer and leave it on all day. I feel like it gives the best glow and my face feels so freaking moisturized after. Take it down to the neck again. Okay, 
moving forward. Now I'm going to be showing you what I do as far as makeup. So, first thing I do is I go in with some concealer just to hit up these bad boys. And I am using the Kylie Cosmetics concealer in the color Maple. I'm only using a little. And I'm gonna blend it in with my beauty blender. I feel like I just said I use a little and that was kind of a lot. But I just don't wanna look like a monster right now. Kinda wanna look cute, refreshed. I don't want to use any foundation or um, CC cream because I feel like that's just a lot for right now. And I'm being like, I'm in the house with my parents and Sean, so we're not seeing anybody, we're not going anywhere, so. Okay, next I'm gonna be taking a little bronzer I'm using the Benefit Hula Bronzer and a random Real Techniques brush that I've had since forever. Just to give a little color to my face, I have been out in the sun during this whole situation. So I'm not too pale, but just to give a little definition and a little Next. Not too much effort, ladies. Not too much effort. Honest Beauty Blush. This is their cream blush in the color Coral Peach. I freaking love, one, I love a Jessica Alba. Two, I love this blush. I take a little in my beauty blender and put it on my cheekbones. Okay, wow, this is like really picking up on camera I feel like but it's not I can't really see it in person okay hi what do I think I am Tati little on my nose. Hi, can you appear? Okay. Brows. I like my brows thick and um, bushy and wild. So I am going to fill these bad boys in a little. Because again, we're not putting a lot of effort into this whole quarantine look just to look a uh, alive and my husband doesn't get scared. Eyebrows have been filled in. Curling my lashes with my eyelash curler. Mascara, I am taking L'Oreal Bambi Lash, Bambi Eye, sorry. This stuff is awesome to make your eyes look, um, give that like doe eyed effect. Sorry if I'm looking down, my mirror's right here. Also, I'm in my parents' house. I don't know if I said that already. This is why the setup is different. I love 
this mascara. I feel like it makes me look. Megan, say alive one more time. Okay. Last thing I'm going to do is one, my Laneige lip gloss in the color Berry. Love Laneige. I feel like I talk about it in every video. Okay. And then last but not least, give a little brush to the brows again. Honestly, forget it. Maybe I'll do a little, go a little wild, add a little highlight. This is just a Stila highlight in brilliance. I think you can hear my cat pee. Sick. Okay. That is it, ladies and gentlemen. Very easy. Look not to scare the people you are stuck with. So, if you liked this video, let me know in the comments below. And be sure to like and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!